Hello there, I'm Kevy. I'm also known as the Immersive World Crafter. I'm a tabletop wargaming creator of terrain features within a scenery and I fabricate all manner of man-made constructs at a miniature scale. You'll find that I go deep on the detail, way, way, way deep to create a lot of atmosphere and narrative within the terrain. It'll tell a story and have a huge amount of purpose. If that sounds like the type of experience you would like to have on your gaming tables, then go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And don't forget to ring the bell to have me ping every time I post new content. Now, there are already a number of talented tabletop terrain scenics producers with channels online. I believe it's important to let you know how I am positioning myself so that you won't be watching a repeat of information you get elsewhere. Before I do that, I need to describe who I am positioned alongside. Firstly then, Mal the Train Tutor has been providing the community with know-how on the tools of the trade, materials and the techniques with pointers on common issues that can arise and how to solve them. He has a funded Kickstarter for his upcoming book, Terrain Essentials, that I'm proud to say I've backed and I'm in excited anticipation for. If you're new to terrain building, look no further than Mal's channel for an incredible grounding on how to get started on the correct footing. Secondly, Luke's affordable paint service. Luke shows us how to get durable and realistic terrain complete cheaply, easily and quickly with some proven methods without compromising on any quality whatsoever. In fact, his terrain builds make the battlefields he produces look natural with a high, high level of realism. It's great stuff. He has taken the discipline by storm with the release of his own range of products released through Geek Gaming. I use these products all the time and endorse them for speeding up processes and creating greater realism. So much so, I'm also a Luke's APS reseller myself. That brings us back to me. I'll be taking any scenery landform or terrain structure and like I said before, I'll be going deep on the detail. This is all with the goal of creating an atmospheric narrative gaming experience that envelops the player, surrounding them in a game that they're completely involved in. This goes very much hand in hand with what excites me about the hobby essentially. I enjoy narrative skirmish battles such as Games Workshop's Inquisitor and Necromunda or Mantic's The Walking Dead. I also take great enjoyment in listening to books and reading the backstory behind the game. These skirmish battles have a goal in mind. They're each very deliberate with a purpose that has a story to it. To perform that story and entertain, they usually contain a whole host of terrain features and props and those features need to deliver on that narrative to allow the game to flow and become an immersive experience. For in-depth instructions on how to create these types of gaming boards or simply get inspired by what I do to take into your own projects, hit the subscribe button and don't forget to ring the bell to have me ping every time I post new content. I wouldn't want you to miss out on that content. If you're serious about immersive gaming experiences and narrative play on the tabletop, you are going to want to watch my guides. Thank you for watching my introduction to the channel and I'm looking forward to taking you on our journey into crafting immersive worlds. Until the next time, see you again.